Welcome to the PC Masterist making of. So, in order to stay in line with the original design, I used the 30 minute edit version that I found on YouTube as a reference. Then, took a photo of a screen and keyboard from Google, and we also have to get a still picture somewhere. But I thought it was not enough, and we kind of need a game poster for the background. I'm sure you can guess which game I'm going to use for that. Come on, think about it. Star Citizen! That is a PC Masters game. That is a game you can't even try. Yeah, oh yeah, you really can try. We are still missing the ultimate match for this. Can you guess who needs to be part of the video? And this one's a bit harder, but think about it. Linus Tech Tips. You cannot make a more PC Masters video than him. I mean, look at his face. Even him knows it's too much. Jokes aside, let's jump into a more interesting part at least for the one who are looking for a video making job. Modization of the keyboard and screen are at the top, laying out of all the elements is at the bottom left corner, and at the bottom right you get the creation of the character using curves. The most enjoyable part for me was animating the hair. It's at this moment the project came to life, so there is a way modificator in Blender you can play with. Um, playing is a good term for it, I enjoyed it a lot. Then we just need to bring down the animation into a set of pictures. Here we only need 10 of them to break it down. I imported all of them into After Effects so I could create the illusion of a movement and add a volumetric light effect as trying to bake such a feeder in Blender would consume too much time and horsepower. It's a bit like cheating, but it gets the job done. The animation coming out of After Effects is only a 3 second one. Then I just use Premiere Pro, any video software you like, in order to repeat that 3 second while the music will play on the background. Well, you know, just some stupid text and I was ready to bake it. That's all. Thank you for sharing this moment with me. Videos like this ones are exceptional, as it was a training for me and a way to get attention. As a matter of fact, my channel is going to heavily focus on 3D printing designs in relation to fantastical universes, movies, mangas, games, and slowly moves toward the cosplay world. My plan is to model using a 3D software, print, sand down, smooth, paint, add light or electronical parts to the object in order to sell it. You can see my last prototype as of February 2018 here, which is not up to the quality I want to achieve, but is getting closer. Even more if you know where I started. The next project will be Lumiere from Beauty and the Beast. Yeah, I do know that basically I do not have the authorization from Disney, but as for today, I'm still not seeing those, so it's okay. So, for those who are interested, I recommend you to subscribe to this channel, especially as a newcomer, I could use some help. Please. Links in the description to Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, DeviantArt, and all the bullshit. Uh, maybe soon, my own website, but I would not rely on that. It could take me some time, for reasons. When it comes to finance, uh, I will be honest, I do not have a lot of money left and everything comes from my pocket, which makes it quite hard. I am soon going to sell some of my products and maybe do a Kickstarter, but that will be for later. At the moment, I'll see you in the next video with Lumière, and yes, I do plan on editing and making off of it. Thank you!